Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dead by Daylight video. It's Aaron here, and today I'm going to be doing the new solo getaway build. This build is better than the old one because I'm going to be running Soul Guard instead of Tenacity, which will help so much with my Unbreakable towards the end of the game. Once again, thank you all for the support, and if you're part of the large percentage of people who watch my videos and aren't subscribed, consider subscribing and leave a like if you enjoy. Let's get straight into the first game. Alright, let's go. We are in on the Fractured Cow Shed. It's a Michael Myers. Oh my god. And he is right there. Oh, Yui. We can prove thyself the gen. Oh, I'm just gonna hide behind the gen. <laughs> what? He knows. Are you kidding me? No. Oh, he doesn't have a red light either. Alright, I'm gonna go heal. I'm scared. I don't like this. Dude, this Michael Myers has like the biggest brain I've ever seen. <laughs> Alright, this is perfect. I can get my deliverance up now. Ooh, that's really bad though. He's hooking him on a hill. Alright, I'm going for the save. Hopefully I get it before the Yui. So I gotta get my deliverance. Alright, nice. Oh no, he's got tier 3. That's not good. I'm gonna try and get this gen while the guy gets chased. Oh no. It's coming. It's not good. I'm gonna greed a little bit. And I'm definitely throwing it down right here. We have another pallet here if he does commit to us. He left us. Okay, that guy's up. We just gotta get four gens. I mean, that's not very easy, but it's fine. Oh no, he's going for me. Okay. Oh, he lost his power, so I'm just gonna greed now. Whoa. This man's got the longest arms I've ever seen. All right, I'm just gonna reset again. I can't go down till the end of the match because I want to get Deliverance into the hatch. That would be awesome. All right. He's already got his power again. No. Ooh, they're so close to getting that gen too. Gonna pick up the Yui. All right. Need to run. Ooh, that guy's already getting the save. Nice. All right, we're in a good situation. As long as we can get that gen, that'll be really good. And we have a really good setup here. If I bait him to chase me here, I have the long wall. Okay, come on, come on, come on. We can get this thing to run. His power's gone. Nice. I can take a hit for the UE now. That's fine. Commit to that. We get the vault. Oh, no, this isn't good. We can't loop with friends here. I'm gonna greed that again. He swung, nice. Okay, that gives me enough time. I can run all the way over here. And now I have an amazing setup with this long wall. If he was to commit to me here, I can just vault the long wall and he won't be able to do anything about it. And I've got another pallet there. This setup is actually crazy. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I make it the pallet now because of that. Nice. I need to try and get the seal off. I don't think I can. I'm gonna vault that. Nice. I can still vault it one more time too, and I still have the other pallet as well. Nice. And now we can loop him on this. And we still have the other, other pallet too. I remember. We didn't use that yet. Okay. I don't think I get a heal off. No, I'm 99 on my heal. Oh, that's so bad. Okay, I see my teammates because of Kindred. That's really good. Okay, we have one guy getting chased over there. I need to get this guy to tap my heal real fast. I can actually heal. No, I should go for the save. I should get that. Nice. Kindred actually helping so much here. And then one more gen in the corn. It was so close to being finished. I'm going to leave that guy to run the shack. Okay, we triple this gen with Prove Thyself right now. Okay, I'm going to go try and take hits for my teammate now. Because I have Deliverance, DS, Unbreakable, Soul God. I have everything going for me right now. 
totem right here. What is happening? What is happening? He has some sort of totem in the shack. I don't know what it is, though. You get that? What? I heard the sound of him getting stunned. I don't know how he didn't get that. Okay, wait. Oh. Oh, he's dead. I don't even think the gate's open here. Oh, no. He knows I'm here. Okay. Kindred helping me out. I don't know what this guy is doing. Oh, there he is. He's just trying to stalk. I need to just run away across the entire map. We know we still have that one pallet as well, which is good. Oh, he expects me to go that way. Nice. We know we have that pallet. I'm just going to play this pallet. If I can stun him. Nice. I need to find the gate. I don't even know if I have to use my deliverance. I might actually be fine. He lost me. Nice. Where was the hatch? The hatch is at the shack. I just need my teammate to leave. All I need is for this last guy to leave. And I'm at the shack. On the hatch. Oh no, he didn't swing. No, unlucky. Okay, hatch is in the shack. If this last guy just leaves right now, I'll be fine. Okay, please. No, he's gonna know. What? He missed. Oh my god. <laughs> No way. How did he miss me on the stairs? I have no clue. GG's. GG's, man. All right, let's go. We are in on the Azarov's resting place. And by the sounds of things, I'm pretty sure we're missing a Billy, as I did hear a chainsaw. I don't know where he is, though. Okay. Well, at least I'm not already dead. All right, gen done. This is a massive dead zone. That is not good. Oh yeah, that's really bad. He took him in the basement, but at least I get ruined. That's really good. And this guy is open-handed and kindred. That's actually sick. Kindred's gonna help so much here. I can just beeline around the entire shack a bunch of times without risking anything. Yep. Alright, let's go down. Let's get the save. And make sure it doesn't come back first. Wait. I want to make sure. Nope, he's coming back. That's not good. Okay. He doesn't make that. <laughs> yeah, these guys need to get saved. I, I think I'm going to let these guys save. I don't want to get the first save because he's in a very unsafe place. And if I save without BT down there, we could be in a really bad spot. Okay, nice. Guy got M1'd. Nice. Yeah, see, that's, that's why I didn't save because that guy would be dead right now. <laughs> that's really lucky. Oh, he actually wants to chase me. I'm just going to run away now. We do have a fun bus, which is nice. Oh, I'll take an M1 for this guy. No. I, I don't want to take a chainsaw for him. I will happily take an M1, but I won't take a chainsaw. All right. I'm just going to vault back. I don't mind taking M1s. Yep, that's fine. I can just run far, far away now. Oh, he got picked up. That's so good. I think I've always said this, but the best playstyle against Billy is to just never get chainsawed. As long as you just force them to M1 you on Windows and stuff, you should be fine. Well, unless you're injured, <laughs> then it's not fine. 
Uh, that's awkward. Let me run away. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be more the save I go for, to be honest. Gonna wait, see if he commits to that guy or not. He knows. Wait, what? No, I don't want to save. I don't have BT. I, I gotta be. I gotta be really safe when I save. Okay, wait. No. He can't hold for too long. He overheats. I can get that. And I can take a hit for this guy too. Nice. Try to pick this guy up. Nope, I definitely cannot. Okay, that's fine though. We got our deliverance up. There's only one gen left. This is this isn't that bad. As long as someone does gens while we're like wasting his time here, we're, we're gonna be good. That's fine. I'm just gonna run to the edge here. Can't hit that. Nice. Okay. There should be a pallet over here, right? Oh no, it's gone. That's really bad. He can kill me here if he wanted to. Yep. Okay. Oh my god, I'm so lucky. I am very, very lucky. And now I make it to the shack pallet too. Which I'm gonna greed. Wait. Nancy? Oh, he had BT. He had BT. Okay, that makes sense now. I was so confused. And that guy should still have DS if he does have it. Last gen done. Nice. I can literally die for this guy right now. I, I can die for this guy with deliverance. That's okay. That's completely okay. There's no charge speed add-ons anymore, so it takes him very long to pull up his chainsaw. He's just waiting out DS. Go, go, go. I make that. Um, Nancy, I'm so sorry. This is fine though. I can die for this guy. I have, I have deliverance. If I just save him, die. Nice. Now Nancy gets away. Okay. And now I just pop my deli. And no matter what now, I make it to this gate a hundred percent. There's nothing this guy can do. There is absolutely nothing. He has to pick up DS. And if he doesn't, I have Unbreakable Soul Guard. I'm out 100%. There's no way. There's absolutely no way this guy kills me now. This is so perfect. If he picks me up right now, I DS. If he doesn't pick me up, I crawl to the gate with Unbreakable Soul Guard and I'm out anyway. And... That's enough time for Soul Guard. Even if he hits me now, I'm fine. And we're out! That is actually so good. If he picked me up, I would have just decisived him. If he doesn't pick me up, Unbreakable Soul Guard. This build is so good. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.